Hello, hi, it's me, Andrew B. We're continuing with Final Fantasy X HD. Outside we go. Hey, sleepyhead. Something I want to give you. Whoa, you're giving this to me? Yeah, use it well. That's the sword you gave Chapu. Well, he never used it. Where's Yuna? We're taking the same boat as Yuna, right? Why do we gotta wait here? Yuna came to this village ten years ago, when the last calm started. The calm? Since then, she's been like a little sister to me and Lulu. But she had the talent. She became an apprentice. Now, today, she leaves as a summoner. This is our journey. We should leave together. You really don't need all that luggage. Ah, uh, they're not really my things. Th they're gifts for the temples we're to visit. This isn't a vacation, you know. I guess... I guess you're right. It's one, unless I'm missing something, it's one piece of luggage. Okay, off we go. So before we actually begin our journey, I'm hoping this won't take very long. I want to find this fucking dog. Um, real quick. Nope. Oh. You know, a funny thing happened. My dog dug up something yesterday. I wonder what it is. I just want to make sure the dog's not anywhere. Oops, sorry. It's not here anywhere. Because that means I have to find the damn thing. And I don't know where it is. And I have to look for it. It's somewhere in this village, I'm telling you. But... Oh yeah, I might want to get these two. in here. I know the dog's here somewhere. So frustrating. I guess I gotta check all the buildings because it ain't anywhere that I've seen in town. something mangled and slobbery, Valifor has learned Overdrive Energy Blast. Thank you. Goodbye. Now we can begin our journey. 
Man, look at that very dark part in between his hair. I just noticed that. Like, you have such blonde hair, and then you see the dark-ass roots like that. Like, damn, that's noticeable. Here comes one now. Hey, why don't you try out that sword I gave you? No problem! Not too shabby. You kept up with him pretty well. Might make a good guardian someday. A flyer! My kind of customer. This brings up the question. Oh no, we can't move there. Well, we could move there, but we're not moving there right now. We're moving over here. And we're going to use a speed sphere to get his agility up. Like that. I also want to switch out for Lulu because I love using Lulu. I, I don't know. My three favorite characters, the ones I definitely overuse, are probably Orin, Lulu, and then honestly just a combination of everybody, but mostly Titus, specifically that for like trouble. haste. This. Told you, only magic can beat that thing. If you can't beat them down, you gotta use magic of an element they don't like. Magic? Element? Let's have our black mage show you what I mean. Lou, you're up. Clueless, aren't you? Good thing I'm here. Elements. Magic and fiends have properties called elements. There are four elements, fire, ice, lightning, and water. Fire and ice are opposed, as are lightning and water. Spells of ice work well against fire fiends. And ice fiends are weak against fire magic. You follow? I get fire and ice, but what about lightning and water? Lightning and water are opposed, just like fire and ice. This one here is a water fiend, which means... I do enjoy Lulu and the whole bunch. Take your time. Let's get going, man. We're gonna wait. Huh? Are you ready? What's going on? It's an ancient custom. People leaving the island pray here for a safe trip. Chapu didn't pray that day. Said he'd miss his boat. That should do it. Ooh, there it is. Hold on, what is that? Join as one. See, normally you wouldn't be able to understand that, but I do, so. Ah, uh, yes. This.
a very quick boss fight. That's enough. What's with that guy? Kimari Ronso, of the Ronso tribe. He's learned the fiend's way of fighting. That's not what I meant. He's another Yuna's guardian. Huh? <laughs> Sometimes we don't understand him either. Kimari doesn't talk much anyway. Mm. But he has protected me since I was a child. Hmm. Huh. Okay, and I think that, yep, um, yeah, well that helps, oh, I also gotta put that on her, uh, can I equip, yeah, I can equip, okay. We're just gonna keep going. Right? True, true. But, uh, why don't we let our summoner show us what she's made of? So, pressing L1 during battle to switch. Press L1 during a battle to switch in a character not currently being used. Just switch them in, and they're ready to go. Like this. Your first real battle. Show us what your training is taught. Okay. Summoning Aeons. Use the summon command to have Yuna call an Aeon in to aid her battle. Only Yuna can summon Aeons. No shit, Sherlock. Use it when you need help against tough opponents. Basically, just use it against other bosses. When Aeons take damage, their HP decreases. Should their HP reach, reach, should their HP reach zero, they will leave battle and become unavailable for a time. Aeons recover HP at save spears just like normal. So literally, what we're gonna do here is do this. Now we can do stuff like this. I didn't need to use his overdrive, that would have been a waste. It's better to save it to use later. <gasps> Ooh! A new cat! Ooh, yay, it's a cat. I love when it's a cat. Yay, I love cats. I love the cat Sith, they're so cute. Also, if we go. Um, can't go down there yet? No, oh, well. one of those. No problem. Leave this one to me, huh? Say good night, birdie. Yeah. Is 
So you're just gonna do that. Because then you can get out of here and also look at the cute little kitty. I love it. Sorry, I just love the cat so much. Anyway, you are going to get out and replace. So this this is what I was talking about in an earlier when I said switch out as you can. Everybody needs to get experience. That's why you get her. She attacks once and then she's out. Especially, and then again, during boss fights. Let, uh... Everybody attack first and try not to get them killed. Then let Yuna come in and do her summon thing so that she can basically take it and do it. Everybody else gets, uh, you know. Grid. So we're going to move that down here. And then we're going to use an ability spear to learn Null Blades. And we'll be also learning Null you might no shock, no frost, and no tide, as we also learned Cure and Insuna, and we'll be learning other stuff along the way. But let's keep going. Literally one for everybody. when they level up. So we're moving down. And we're going to use our spear. There we go. Nope. There we go. Going to move. And we're going to learn... Flee! Now we can return to the main menu. Do, 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 do. Anybody else? Guess not. Wait for me. There we go. Okay, goodbye, everybody. Okay, so something I didn't know and I only learned recently, look, <laughs> you can walk around while doing this. <laughs> oh my god. I didn't know what, I don't know why they kept this ability in. Oh my god. It's <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> oh my god. I love it. I wonder if I could have walked off the boat and like when the kids doing it I could just walk past them and be like hi. <laughs> oh god. Well, our first stop is Kilika Port as we're heading to Kilika Island. But first, we will be spending time on the SS Leaky. Leaky? Leaky. 
Who? Come to think of it, I haven't told you where we're going. First to Kilika Island. Then we change boats and head for Luca. For that though, Yuna's gotta pray at the temple. I'll be guarding. We'll be praying for the Aurochs victory too, so you come along, yeah? <sighs> great plan. Hey, it is a great plan. Don't look at me. <laughs> I don't know who you are, or where you came from. If you interfere with Yuna's pilgrimage, we won't take it lightly. I don't know who... I'll do that later, because I don't want to fuck up the jack shot bit, so let's go down. Fascinating clothes you're wearing. Oh dear God. Yeah! Filthy, filthy. These won't sell. All me names, not a walker. Don't look like you got much money either. I've no business with you. Add him away. Who do you think you are? A walker the 23rd. Merchant extraordinaire. A walker the who? Don't know me? Well, not many do. Not yet. Oh dear lord. And we'll be dealing with, well, let me talk to him now and then I'll finish the episode. But someday, the Naima Walker will be spoken. Say, lad, you wouldn't have a bit of gill to lend. Gee, would I have a half a bend of gill, I suppose. I'd rather do this now because that gets it at least a little bit off the ground if I give, yeah, 1,001. I guess it pays to ask, thank Fine seed money for the Oaka Merchant Empire. I'm sure. Much obliged, lad. Have you... Have I got some to lend? Uh... No. Because as it says here in the book, if you give them zero to a hundred, you get this. If you get them a thousand to this, if you get them this to this. So I did the third level, which should bring his prices down to 1.2, their standard, which is better than 2.0 standard, I guess. Uh, anywho, I think that will do it for us today. Uh, well, not today, but for this episode. Soon we'll be in Kilika port and dealing with other stuff. But for now, we are on this boat. So, I, what the hell? Oops. Either way. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. And hit the subscribe button if you want to see more content from me, Andrew B. And I am going to be signing off from Final Fantasy X. <gasps> Thanks! Oh. I was just going to try to run into the... Oh look, Chocobos! Oh, what the heck is that? What, what the heck is what? What is this place? The power room, like it says on the door. Yeah, but why the big birds? What's so strange about Chocobo power? Chocobos? Those are Chocobos? What? You've never seen a Chocobo? What kind of backwater island did you come from, anyway? Hmm. <sighs>
Miracles and oddities were starting to become daily routine on this trip. Well, that's not where I meant. Uh, who cares? It's a better part. But look, Chocobos! They're so cute. Anyway, let's try that again. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this, please leave a like, subscribe, blah, 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 blah. Goodbye.